Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Friday Night Smackdown. It's WrestleMania season as we are nine days removed from the Elimination Chamber. And Ryan Wade will face his toughest challenge to date as he will have to defend the WWE Championship against five of SmackDown's best. This man had the opportunity to get revenge against the authority last week but the best communication between himself and his brother Roman Reigns led to Reigns accidentally hitting him with a spear with the authority capitalized and won the match. Last week Roman Reigns costed me my shot at making the authority pay by spearing me. If you guys thought this is over, you're making a huge mistake. I've done a lot of thinking while I was in that institution, but I know that Seth Rollins is the real reason behind the framing, and of course his girlfriend was more than ready to play along. So I will be turning my full attention to Rollins for now. I will however not be letting Rage off the hook that easily. I have a huge surprise for him. But for now, my challenge is to Seth Rollins. What do you say? You and me, one on one, at the Elimination Chamber. This is not the man Dean Ambrose was looking for. He just told Rage that he has a huge surprise for him. Maybe Wild Rage is up here to find out what the hell that surprise is. Even though Ambrose said he's going to be turning his full attention to Seth Rollins for now. What the hell Dean Ambrose be talking about? Listen man, it's Wrestlemania season and in 9 days I'll have to defend the WWE Championship inside the Elimination Chamber to ensure that I head into Wrestlemania 32 as the World Champion. I don't have time for games, if you have a surprise for me, give it to me like a man, to my face. Don't worry, you'll find out soon enough. Fine then, have it your way. If you want the match against Seth Rollins at the Elimination Chamber, You'll have to earn it by beating me one on one here tonight. Wow, this night can't get any better. Get a referee out here. Let's do this right now. And the referee has indeed made his way to the ring. This match is underway. The first match right here tonight will be T Numbers versus Ryan Rage. T Numbers opened the show. And said he believed that Seth Rollins is the man behind the framing. And he will be turning his full attention to Seth Rollins. He can't focus on two men at the same time. But he also said that Ryan Rage is not off the hook. He have a huge surprise for him. Rage said it's WrestleMania season. He don't have time for games. Amberson told him what the hell that surprise is he was talking about. Ambrose refused and said Rage will find out soon enough. Rage then challenged Ambrose to a match. Right here tonight with the stipulation if Dean Ambrose wins, he will earn the right to face Seth Rollins at the Elimination Chamber. Punishing the opponent. What's this? 
Ambrose is distracted by Volus's theme song, but Volus is standing the right thing with the steel chair. Chair shot to the head of Dean Ambrose, and the assault by Seth Bullets continues. Who the hell is this? A masked man is making his way towards the ring. It's Seth Rollins now going off the him and he runs into a Superman punch. This masked man is now heading towards the ring and he turns his attentions to Ryan Rage. He hits Rage with a TKO. The Superman punch he used to take down Rollins was one of Ryan Rage's signature moves as well. Who the hell is this man? Why the hell that he used Rage's moves? I guess we'll have to wait until next time. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you all next time.